Hello guys, today I'm going to be talking about the PS4 and Xbox One games at launch and like after launch. Today uh, I'll start with the Xbox One exclusives Forza 5, Dead Rising 3, Local Cycle, Rise Son of Rome, Killer Instinct, and Connect Sports has been removed from the launch, but I really don't care about that. PS, the, I'll go to the PS4 exclusives now. That will include Drive Club, Killzone Shadowfall, DC Universe Online, and Venture Knack. And that's much of it. Um, games that will come out after launch, I'll start with the Xbox exclusives again. Halo, which will always be one. Minecraft, Xbox One Edition. Titanfall, which isn't currently on the PS4, which is pretty sad for PS4 users. But... It, it's supposed to come out on a later date. The reason it didn't come out for the PS4 was because the PS4 wasn't strong enough for the game, apparently, according to Titanfall, the creators of it. Now, I'm going to talk about the games that will come out both on the Xbox One and the PS4 at a later date. Well, Assassin's Creed 4, I mean, not at a later date, but Assassin's Creed 4 will be out, Black Flag will be out on the Xbox One and PS4, Battlefield 4. Call of Duty Ghosts, Destiny, which will be coming out at a later date next spring, apparently. Elder Scrolls Online, there's no date for that yet. FIFA 14, Madden 25, Metal Gear Solid 5, The Phantom Pain, Need for Speed Rivals, and NBA 2K14, and NBA Live 14. And one of the most, the, one of the most I'm excited for is Watch Dogs. Now I'm gonna talk about the games, um, how Xbox One and PS4 like decided to do it. For the PS4, Watch Dogs is gonna come out with four extra missions. This is an exclusive for PS4 users, which is pretty awesome. It'll bring in another hour worth of the game. For Assassin's Creed, Black Flag, it's gonna bring the main woman that, well, the main lady that led the role in Assassin's Creed 3. For on the Xbox One, pre-orders of Battlefield 4 will bring the China Expansion Pack only for the Xbox One. And COD Ghost Maps for Xbox One will be before the PS4. And I think also for Battlefield 4, the map packs will be a month before the PS4. The Xbox One generation will be the, like the last generation where you get like map packs a month early, which was good, uh, good for P uh, Xbox users. I'm not so excited about that. I'd rather get additional content for free on my games like the PS4. But whatever. I'm looking forward to Watch Dogs and Battlefield 4. Whatever you guys are looking forward to, just let me know down in the comments. Please subscribe, leave a rating on the video, and comment what I should do better since this is like my third commentary or second commentary. And have a good day, guys.